A woman is dead and two others are critically injured after a police chase ended in a crash in Fort Worth. Fort Worth police say officers tried to pull over a pickup truck that had been reported stolen. That driver took off and lost control, rolled and crashed into an innocent driver, Fox Force Peyton Yeager, live on the scene at Alta Mesa Boulevard. Peyton. Steve, and the intersection here at Alta Mesa Boulevard and Will Rogers Boulevard just reopened. Officers cleared the scene and they've been cleaning up the scene since around 1 p.m. this afternoon, so close to five hours. They tell us that just after 1 p.m., a flock camera in the area alerted officers of a stolen truck. Police say the driver of the truck refused to stop for officers, initiating a high speed pursuit in the area. After a few minutes, investigators say the driver of the stolen truck lost control hit a pole and then causing the truck to roll. During the rollover, the truck struck a vehicle passing through the intersection of Alta Mesa Boulevard and Will Rogers Boulevard. The innocent driver of that vehicle was not injured and was able to walk away from the scene. Three people from inside the stolen truck were ejected. Police say one person was killed. The other two people were taken to the hospital in critical condition. There's a constant balancing act, a judgment call that has to be made on the risk of the pursuit versus the necessity to pursue and apprehend offenders, which is what our community expects us to do. Now, police only giving us preliminary information about the stolen truck, only saying the truck is not from Fort Worth, but another city. Investigators did not say which city. They haven't released any information or the identities of the three people who were ejected from the stolen truck, only telling us one person died. Two others are in critical condition in the hospital, and the intersection here off Alta Mesa Boulevard is back open.